Hey there, everybody. That here, and welcome back to that plays the darkest dungeon. Last time, big, large, huge, McHugh, uh, Giscard, Rusty, Shackleford, and Frobois. Apparently, the part of this realm they actually just, you know, went into the into the cove, uh, and then they halted the horror's advances for now. It was pretty great. Pretty great. Yeah, we've beaten the Abyssal Horror, uh, probably more badly than he'd ever been beaten before, to be honest with you. It was uh, quite the thing. Now, let's go from a bunch of level 6s to a bunch of level 1s as we uh, prepare for a new type of journey here. We got the uh, Hot the Beastmaster. Needs to be upgraded here. Give him the fangs of the valley and that incarnation of instinct. Dormente, we need to progress the mutation, iron up these change, and then Carbonyl, need a... Uh, Maybe not get a bug-eating fan. Maybe it's a regular fan. You know, some peasants, guards, Ravenloft, the private deer in the back, already upgraded, of course. All right, definitely upgrading feral cuts. Mm, so good. Uh, good crit chance. Hits twice. What's not the love? Cougar's Leap is also pretty good. It moves him forward so that he can make sure he's still in feral cut range. Could go with Bird of Prey if I wanted to try the opposite, but I don't think that's a great idea. Uh, unwavering. We'll give him a single use slap back it's okay it's okay uh spirit of the hunt this is pretty good it's a buff it gives healing on the next kill for whoever uses it on i think we want to keep that uh we'll take cougar's leap and ravenous as the other moves take away cycle of life because we're not going to use it i think this is pretty good all right tormente we're gonna upgrade everything because he uses everything get that stun chance up in here Carbonyl, uh, definitely gonna have a uh, bustling gale, or, or put this, or um, invoke a Nenra. It's really good too. Um, minus accuracy, minus healing received. Yeah, it is really good. Definitely getting calm mind. Definitely getting thalassic remedy. Uh, I think I'm gonna take the single target damage though. Yeah, because Ravenot. Well. Take a look. Belay, Dissonant Chord, all he does is debuffs and buffs. He is pure support. So we're going to see how that works out for us. All right. Let's head out. Where are we going with this team? Believe it or not, we're going to go try to fight a boss. We're going to take on the Viscount, if we can. All right. Well, let's start with Hot. He's Hot stuff, and he's got two birds. Well, we only need one bird, so... We'll, we'll drop a bird. Uh, extra crit on the first round. Extra dodge in the front. Extra speed in the back. Eh, it's, it's fine. Extra bleed chance. Extra healing received from eating, but double food consumed. Don't want double food consumed. No corpses required. Eh, we're not using that, so don't worry about that. None of your trinkets are required today. Dormente. Extra damage and speed at the cost of, what, 3 HP? That's I think that's worth it. Uh, less stress done from transformation. Less transformation stress. Yeah, let's grab that. Why not? We might not even use it, but it doesn't hurt to have. Uh, extra HP, no food consumed, what's not to love? Uh, we actually don't need the debuff chance. Although it does give extra healing done. That's pretty good. Revenant, do we have anything for the privateer? We do, actually. Friendly skill, buff the party's resistances. Yep. Nice grog barrel. Less healing and stress healing done at the cost of, or at the benefit of HP and damage. Don't need that. Don't need that. He's a little weedy, of course, as well. Extra stress received if no medicinal herbs. Well, we always take some, so I guess that'll be fine. All right. So, here's the thing. Your role, Revenant, is actually going to be use these debuffs. He's got Belay, which lowers speed and stun resist. <laughs> uh, but also Dissident Cord, which does a little bit of damage. But also lowers the enemy's damage, dodge, and accuracy. He also has a Drunken Shanty, which gives us extra healing and stress healing received. If that's for the whole battle, that's broken. Um... <laughs> At least it's gonna be. So, what we want is more things that have an on-hit debuff effect. That's really the big thing we're looking for. Um, I mean, we could also get... Well, no, we can't. It wouldn't work. But there are items that, you know, like... Range attacks cannot inflict bleeding. And last I checked, yeah, playing music and yelling at people, they are both considered ranged attacks. So they're not that useful here. That's okay. That's okay. We don't need that. All we need... Is stuff the debuffs on hit. So that's going to be like the Wadden Sword, Wadden Horse combo. That's going to you. It's all right. Low is damage anyway, so we don't need it for that. Extra damage, less damage received as well. That's pretty helpful. So that's the big one. Now the enemies take more damage. 
Uh, do we have anything that can actually raise debuff chance? Not sure that we do. If we do, I'd like it. Extra speed. Probably don't need even more speed. I could be wrong on that. I've been wrong before. But I feel like we don't need more. Hmm. There's extra debuff chance and accuracy. Oh, both of those would be good. On attack, lower the enemy's speed. Boom. Uh, there's a couple other trinkets to go with. I don't think we need them. Yeah, just take that one. I think that's more than good enough for right now. Alright, let's head down a little bit farther. See what we got going on down here. Do we have anything else that ups debuff chance? Probably not. But I have to check. We have a moonshine keg. It's not really that great. Uh, are there really no other debuff chance trinkets that we got? There really aren't. All right, then. Oh, there you go. At the cost of one speed, you know what? I'll take 15 extra debuff chance. Okay. I think that's all we're getting, really. We got this rack of glass vials, but that's not that useful. Not for this particular person. Minus accuracy to range skills. Definitely don't need that. I can take these. I'd like the extra crit chance and the extra accuracy. There's more crit and accuracy. Uh, minus healing done if the torch is low. Minus move resist in the front. Minus trap disarm chance if the torch is low. That's actually not that bad. <laughs> For a little bit of extra accuracy and crit, that's actually not that bad. And then how about we give you that speed back? There you go. Cool. Carbonyl. Oh, actually, mm, nix the speed back. Give me the uh, life soul key. All right, back to Carbonyl. Um, you're going to get the heal set up, of course. You get the happy doll. You get the angry doll. You get the other doll. You get every doll. Uh, you get the last light. You get the first light. You get all the lights. There you go. Okay. Oh, Ravenoff should get the veggie daggles. That's what he should get. He barely does any damage. Yeah, give him that instead of the key. That's actually even better. Um. Oh, drums and rattle. Don't forget those. Okay. Good. Tormente. You, I would like to increase your chance of stuns, but also you got blights, and you know how to use them. Both of your uh, non-transformed abilities are ranged, which means that the hemlock and stuff won't be that useful for you necessarily. That said, you could still use blights. Uh, here, take this dice. Yeah, a little bit of extra accuracy and crit for you. Maybe a little bit of extra blight chance and blight resist to boost? Seems good. Seems good, right? Might not be, but it seems like it is. Mm. What else do we give the guy who has everything? Um, I mean, he has, he has a lot. There's some stun chance. The cost of a lot of HP, though. And that has me a little bit concerned. I'm not going to lie. Let's give you a handy flare. Because we need to give some out. Not really, but I feel like we should give some out. You'll take the soul key. You'll take the dazzling charm. You'll take the stun stone. There we go. And then hot... This is where things get nuts. Get a life soul key. Get a war soul key. You're gonna get the shackles. You're gonna get the mask. You're gonna get the tops. You're gonna kick some ass. Let's give you the handy flare as well. And you know, I feel like you gotta get... Ooh, the pen. <laughs> uh, and the, uh, more importantly, the grimoire. Oh, gosh, what's his health going to be at? Like, 18? Oh, God, it's worse! Ugh, 17 health. That's okay. He'll be fine, right? Please be fine. All the food, all the shoves. Uh, let's go with five anti-venom, five bandage venom. A couple of medicinal venoms. Three keys, three holy waters, all the laudanum, all the torchinums. Uh, don't need the fragment, I don't think. We have 48 presents. Um, bring a stack of cure. Whoa, not a stack. Whoa, bring four cures. Uh, bring a stack of blood in case we need it. Okay, let's go fight the Viscount. The Viscount has set the table, by the way. You hungry yet? Does this not make you hungry? Look at all that food. Look at all the pig. How is not that not all desiccated? Like, the rest of it I can understand. It's probably fresh. But uh, the pig? How's that not gone? It's gotta be here, over here. We're going to basically a big U-turn. 
All right, big old horseshoe. The theory was right. Uh, we'll, we'll use the holy water here. Oh, wait, that's the one you're not supposed to use holy water on. All right, we'll use uh, medicinal herbs here. Hey, I got that one right. Finding the stuff is only the got first a lot test. of food out of it, too. Now it must be carried home. Probably too much. Anyway, uh, we should be fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a little bit of a whoopsie, but, you know, should have shoveled that, I believe, if I remember correctly. I don't know if I do anymore. I also should be having uh, Carbonyl touch all these so that I can get extra stuff. Otherworldly corruption. Now, I played this game once. Darkest Dungeon is pretty great. Uh, you know, if you use the right people to interact with the right stuff, you can get bonus stuff. It's it's awesome. I should try it sometime, probably. Yeah, that's right. Interact with that trap. Beautiful. Well, at least it didn't shuffle us or anything. Immediately with the thirst. And there's the curse. Oh, he tried. He didn't get it, but he tried. All right, we're not getting much luck with the dodges over here. Well, you know what? Those going first, there's an advantage to that. And that advantage is, um... Yeah, go ahead and just kill him. As the, fiend falls, the advantage the fiend is that, uh... Well, we don't have to worry about the curse now, that's what. Uh, oh, Dissident Chord can only be used from the middle, too. That's a problem. Belay can be used from anywhere, though, so we can still do this. Which is still a lowering of the enemy's speed by nine and stun resist. That's still good stuff, undeniably. Uh, lock them, please. Okay. Uh, give me a little bit of this. A devastating blow. Easy breezy, beautiful stun. I got practically no stun resist, which is kind of amazing. Burn them. Continue the onslaught. Get burned, son. Destroy. Comes the rage. It's kind of undying, but that's already right. can't hit shit anyway. Cool. Right. Uh. Well, at least try to hit him. Your accuracy's kind of trash. Uh. Give me the stun. Guaranteed. Literally guaranteed. Zero stun resist. Um. Keep, keep playing. There we go. Minus 46 stun resist. He's got the bonus, and it's still at, like, a very small amount. No okay, we're losing that accuracy. We're not actually getting the accuracy back, either. And we're not getting the accuracy back because I don't... I don't have an item on him that gives it back, and I'm not using our heal moves. Which is what will give them back. Their formation as long as I broken. understand this, you know, we can Maintain work around it. It is going to make me wish I would brought more medicinal Success herbs, but... So clearly eh. in view. I didn't. Or is it merely a trick of okay, the you light? You touch this. Give me a fish. I'll Literally take a dragon. Gold, nice. Trinkets and baubles. That's what I wanted. In blood. That's what we needed the whole time. Couple carrion eaters, a horrible that's eh, not that bad. Shuffle. Um Okay. That's not what I expected. Confusion. I don't even remember what that does. Give me the double blight. All right, well, we got a single. It's still a good blight. It's enough to get a kill. Belay at them. Some big, beautiful debuffs still. Uh, to Really? Really? You're going to do this to me? That's what we're talking about. All right, he's still got some wicked damage on him. Don't munch me, bro. You ask for one fucking favor. You ass. All right. That hurts, but he can get his health back pretty quickly okay up the back maximum damage i appreciate that uh you can't hit them in the back so i say we just go after this all right solid damage at least do it again yes. oh, oh, oh need that stress relief okay that was pretty good that was pretty good oh that's right they have a much lowered speed a powerful blow Thanks to Ravenaut. We still didn't get the kill. God damn it. Uh, move back. Okay, this is somewhat usable still. God damn it. All right. Double damn it. Triple damn it. Oh my god. This was going straight to hell. Uh, give me a, give me a stun. Really? Ugh. All right, well, let's try this. A little bit of a drunken shanty. It does last the whole battle, so that's nice. 
confidence surges Ooh, considering you have no crumbles. accuracy, you're getting pretty accurate here, and I appreciate that. All right. Well, as soon as I talked. Oh, boy. Um, get him. Okay. Ghoulish horrors. Brought low and driven <sighs> Garbage. into the mud. Actual trash. Uh, we could switch out for... And a bottle of rum. You could use the black powder pistol from the back to still do some damage. Hmm. I mean, this is this only buffs himself, though, so that's not that great. It is a big buff, but it's still not that great. And then to put you in the back, you'd have the invoke. Yeah, but it's... That could work. It could. I think we should make a beeline for the boss here. We're still gonna... We're still here. We're not leaving. Not yet. We got plenty of food. Use it. Use that plenty of food. Let's go straight for the boss, though. Do I think we can still win? Yeah, probably. You know, you buff up hot enough. Oh, we're getting our freaking dragon flames, dude. It's the fervor one. Which does give, you know, double damage to the Anenra, but the damage for the Anenra is not that high. No, I bet you it could be pretty strong if we gave him all these, but that's just true of anything. Uh, they would have a really bad negative. Less damage if enemy has below half HP. Less healing done to nothing. Um, all right. You probably have the worst ones, or I have not. So here you go. Cool. Less cool. At least we surprised them. Okay. Another damn sycophant in the, in the back. We still have minus accuracy for one more round, huh? Wow. Go ahead and ditch that. Are you joking me? Are you kidding me? He still gets a buff on damage, but still. Come on now. Jeez, um, dude. All right. Uh, give me the slam. There we go. Okay, no guards. That's good. It's a fair start. Give me the debuffs. Okay. Minus seven speed. More damage received to the front. Uh, give me more debuffs. Okay, now minus 20% healing received as well. Gather the blood. All right, maddening wine. Nice dodge. I appreciate that. And gather the blood. Good dodges. Good dodges all around. Um, go for this. He's too stun resist. Literally 2%. Okay. If we didn't get that, that would be beyond embarrassing. Alright, that was max damage at least. Get second hit, of course. There we go. That was minimum damage. Still got the kill, so it's good enough, you know? Just wait for the bug to fly forward. I feel like he's gonna have to do it soon. Give me the stress healing received. There we go. Put a target on his back too, but that's alright. Six. Yikes. It's hoping for more than that. Especially when it's a guaranteed stun. Jeez um. Ooh, man, he's resisting that. Crimson curse left and right. Oh, there it is. There it is. Oh no, he still resisted. Holy crap, dude. Holy shit, dude. The horror. God damn. Leave him alone. Frickin' hell. There you go. Uh, drink up. There you go. Lowers dodge and move resist, which is not that bad, honestly. Are you fucking kidding me with an 85% chance? God damn, man. That should have been an easy kill. And if y'all can't hit worth the shit, we're not gonna win anyway, so... Jeez, um. All right, we're gonna be fine. Twenty-five percent stun resist. Yeah, that should be guaranteed with the trinkets we got. There it is. Thank you. Thank you, hot. 
Oh, right. It's a free hit. Um, I mean, he still gets the debuff from it, but he also gets the buff, so I guess that works out. Rifling victory, but a victory nonetheless. For the most part. Dude! Oh my god, the fucking bugs and no surprises. The this guy's stealth. Returns even the boldest gaze. Jeez, um. Said it before, I'll say it again. They did like one smart thing by getting rid of the overly long dungeons, but then they just decided to. I don't know, you can't. I don't know how you could fully fix the Crimson Court without a complete overhaul. The more I think about it, it's just really. And um, try it. There it is. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, what are our chances of hitting this boy now, though? Right, it's still pretty decent. Good damage, good damage. I'll take it. Actually, enough for the kill, so literally, actually, great damage. Raging Slight, of course, goes for the stress. It makes sense, it makes great sense. Is the weapon that cuts on its own. Okay. Just tried to burn him out. All right, it is a debuffs. There's the thirst buffs. Ay, ay, ay. His damage range is 46 to 65. And I can't see any of it because he got. There it is, finally. The goddamn fucking Crimson Curse. I'm way too mad for this episode considering how decently everything's going. Honestly. Yeah, I got a little bit of stress. Who doesn't? But, you know. You're actually going to die from the blight, so I'd be better off just trying to kill you. Destroyed. We got it. Took an extra, but we got it. And then get the stress relief. There we go. Cool. Could have gone for the classic remedy instead, I suppose, but I don't feel like we needed it. Here, drink up. The wounds of war can be healed. A little bit of extra for you. But never hidden. All right, he decided to go extra slow this round. I mean, he probably had some debuffs on him. Hey, fish. As victories um, mount, so too will resistance. I'll almost always drop the citrine first, even if it's not always a good idea. Oh my god, there's so many battles. Every room has a freaking battle. Uh, okay. A handsome reward. A more food. For a task well performed. Getting plenty of food up in here. It's a weird, small-ish enemy formation. Of course, they immediately go over the stress. Infallible servitude. God dang it, man. They are built to annoy the fuck out of me. Okay. Let's go, though. Give me the double blight. Are you joking me? I mean, we got it on the Sycophant, which is what I really wanted, but still. Ugh. Ah! Hit the wrong one because of the confusion. God damn it. Precision and oh, at least he went all in and killed him, too. I'll take that. Minus 55 accuracy. Holy crap. Uh, give me the Thalassic Remedy right here. 25 heal and a 12. All right. And more importantly, the little bit of stress or heal. It also gives damage, too. Don't forget about that. There's the other curse. Yeah, yeah. Took me like four fucking missions to get a. to get three curses, but here we're gonna have the whole team cursed when I don't want them to be. Because, of course! Of course! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Suck my horror. Uh, go ahead and get rid of that stress. Go. That'll cost some of it to dip. Actually, quite a bit of it to dip. Eradicated. You ass. What are our actual hit chances here? 50? I mean, I had to go over the 50 50, right? Minus 65 accuracy. It's actually dumb. It's fun, though. It's a fun kind of dumb, I think. I think it is. Oh my god, the fucking bugs, dude. Ugh. I hate these enemies so freaking much. There's also a gatekeeper here, which is interesting. At least I feel like it is. Dude, why are the blight resists so good? 
<sighs> Genuinely hate them. Like actual frickin' hatred. Alright, enraging slight. Yeah, I don't know what else he would do, honestly. Real are oh, you fucking kidding me? Alright. <sighs> I don't I don't even God damn it. Twenty-four percent hit chance. And he got it. And now I can't hit anyone because uh, because of this? Because of this. Look look at this shit. Stupidest shit I ever seen. He actually got a free move. Uh, at least from back here, we can use Spirit of the Hunt. Uh, can't use it on yourself, so I'll just use it up here, I guess. Stupidest goddamn shit. Um, God damn it. And of course, since they were all belayed... Mm, they're all gonna move last. Which means I literally cannot do anything. Um, oh my god. Dude, if you have an enemy team that has a chance of having more than half of it stealth at the start, rethink your fucking life, please. Think about what you're doing and stop. Just stop it. It's stupid. This was dumb. This was two turns. I had to spend doing nothing. Genuinely. Dumbest fucking shit. Might as well. Might as well go for raw damage now. Honestly, I should have built the abomination for damage. Because screw these guys. Uh, Use a medicinal herb here. It's what you get. We'll keep it going too. A time to perform beyond one's limit. Oh yeah, I can't do anything about the uh, about the stress because he's stunned. Isn't that great? Yeah, it's good. Beautiful even. Well struck. Just crit every single one of them, please. All right, let's get this asshole out of here. Uh. Well, go ahead and stress heal. Yeah. The enemy's down to one speed. He'll go slower than everyone else, guaranteed. Uh, you know what? Turn back. There we go. A little bit of stress heal for everyone. And then this for a little bit of stress heal on yourself. You're stress free. That's good. I'll take it. Wadden them here. A little bit of stress heal here. Hey, you don't have lowered speed, right? No, so. Hot should go right now. Okay. Masterfully executed. Good. Thank. Brick. Right. Because of video games. There's literally nothing on the enemy side. Uh. Okay. Ugh. Seize this moment. Why did this fight have this many rewards? It was like a couple of bugs. Um. Take the toy soldier. I don't feel like I need anything else here, so I'm not going to take anything else here. Use some laudanum. Give you some blood. There you go. You give us treasure. You get measure. a plug. Beautiful. Uh, tail plug. And the fool alike. Mm. Mm. It's worth a lot of money. I'll go with the anti-venom. Okay. Let's move on. Here, yeah, you can have some too. You'll give me some crappy trinkets. Yep. Laden with loot are often All right, surprised. what else? Oh, look, another sycophant. My favorite. Okay. What are we doing? I don't know. We're here just to suffer. Yeah, that's great. It's 30 stress. Can't do anything about that. It's cool. Got a double blight at least. An actual double blight for once in our life. And a stun. All right. Beautiful, beautiful. What is... 
What is causing that stun? I actually don't know. Um, we'll go ahead and hit the one who Singular can attack strike. still. There you go. Beautiful, beautiful. Now throw one back here. Hey, hey, hey. Now we're talking. That's the hot stuff I wanted to see. Well, that was probably a waste of a move. <laughs> that was so weak. Mortality clarified in a single strike. Yeah, screw you two. Ugh. Okay. Make sure they have no speed. Oh my god, can you attack the right enemy for once? Thank you. Helps when he's the only one that left on the field. Okay, got ourselves a fish. He's good. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Alright, the only thing I'm overconfident in right now, Ancestor, is that this place sucks. Always has sucked, always will suck. You can't take the suck out of the Crimson Core. That's why the vampires live here. Is my full team gonna have the fucking curse? I swear, if this team gets the full curse before Team Evil does, I'd be so mad. I say that, and you know it's gonna happen. Yep. That's extra stress. Yep. Love it. Mm hmm. Delicious. Alright, alright. Hopefully we can at least get to the Viscount before the stress break, you know? Do me that favor and I'll be alright. Does give us a little bit of that accuracy back, which is great. Um, Slow him down. From 10 to 1 speed. Oh, that's really good. Okay. Excellent. Should be a free stun. Got him. Beautiful. Still don't know where that second stun is coming from. Yay! Extra stress. My favorite. Alright, he's still really slow. Got him. Alright. Oh my fucking god. I mean, I should see that coming, but still, every time it does happen, I'm like, oh my god, I can't believe he missed. Be wary. Is that another fight? God damn it, I hate this place so much. <sighs> Just get the bosses out of the way. That's all you gotta do with that. Just kill the fucking bosses here. And we can go back to living our life. That lowers dodge and accuracy, so that might be more worth it than the speed. Nope, never mind. Of course that hits. Of course it does. Alright. They have a higher hit chance on this one. Got a bleed on him, though. Bleed for six. He's dead. The slow death. Nice. Unforeseen. Appreciate that. Unforgiving. Okay, Undying Rage. Somehow he can hit the front and the back. Not sure how that works, but all right. Whatevs. Really thought you were going to go after Hot, but whatever. Okay, that's fine. No, there it is. There's a stress. Yeah, cool. That's nah, good. Fuck you too, game. The walls close in. The shadows whisper of conspiracy. Of course, he immediately refuses that. All right. Well, at least he can still get a hit every once in a while. Okay. Yay! Honestly, I'm... I'm gonna fire this whole team. I don't care. I don't care if they win. I'm just really... I'm not happy with their performance. Not happy with the makeup. I can get a different one of every single one of these and be okay with it. Honestly, just fire them all. Out of a cannon and into the sun. Throw them off the ship. Alright. 
Doesn't help that the back two were not compatible. And that was a big, huge problem. Honestly, though, I think I... Maybe I'll keep Tormente. He seems to be pretty awesome. He actually seems to be killing it with every single thing I try to get him to do, so... Maybe I should keep him. This fucker, though. See, it's fine, because I could be referring to either one of them. Ugh. Come on. There you go. Let's go kill the Viscount. Oh my god, this is... I don't remember it doing that before. I swear, I know if there was a corpse, it still made you use the move. But I swear that if there were no corpses, it didn't make you actually, like, use the prowl move. Did that change? Was there an update? That accidentally made the character worse? Like, it's not, it's not a huge, like, debuff or anything. This is a waste of time, but still. What's going on with that? Oh my god, give me a fucking break, dude. I'm so tired of this. Every single enemy here is gonna just throw out stress attacks. Ah, I was hoping that would crit so I could say, see, that counts. But it didn't crit, so I guess it doesn't count. Nothing I can do about it. All right, well, seven damage. Frick. I need to save at least one of these medicinal herbs for the boss. So that's what I'm going to try to do. Screw it. Let's fight. Well, that was nice. All things considered. Um, okay, we can still use this, so we'll slow them all down. If only this other sycophant could be moved to the front somehow, but we can burn them all. That's something, and it lowers their healing. So that's cool. Uh, boom, baby. There you go. See? We're not doing nothing. In theory. <sighs> Actually, no, that was good. Thank you. Thank you for switching places there. Give him a little bit of extra damage for the whole battle. All right. Then we're out of laudanum, of course. Because, of course, we're out of laudanum. Because everything these fuckers do give horror. There we go. That's a huge stress debuff, at least on yourself. Or stress relief, I should say. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, get these guys out of my house. That was incredibly... Eh, it wasn't that bad, honestly. You don't have all the attack items on you, after all. Should have went after the other one. I had a 69% chance to hit him, but I didn't. That was my mistake. Hey, still worked. Did not expect that to work, so I'll take it. All right, all right. We still have a bunch of keys. They can be beaten. They have all of our keys still. Waiting to be spent. Well, even if even if the fight goes sideways, as long as one person makes it home, we got uh No, let's not. Can I use anything else with this? Blood? No? Alright. Burn it? No. Alright. I don't want to use my medicinal herbs. We have plenty of food anyway. Hey, some stress relief. In this day and age? I didn't think that was possible. Alright. I feel like those should be... Those should spawn more often. Considering how much they focus on stress here. Taste for morbidity is made more pronounced by his mutation. Alright. Get rid of the accuracy debuff. Slap him twice. We just go after the Viscount. Or at least the uh, Hot does. A decisive pummeling. One of these days, he'll get an extra move on that move. And it'll be a glorious day. But until that happens, enjoy your free stress, I guess. He will heal himself on the bloodstuffed body. Or at least he'll try to. So that has to be taken in, into consideration, too. Ooh, baby! I do not know where he's getting these stuns from, but they're amazing. Alright, the thoist! Of course. 
What else would he do? At least, you know, at least he didn't go for the guard. Hard to complain when he doesn't do that. Okay. Mm. A cr no, 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 no. We need to debuff. If we can. Five damage on him. Yeah, lower his healing received. Because he's going to do this, and he's going to heal by a lot. But, ooh, that was with minus healing received. Yeah, keep that healing received down and we'll be fine-ish. That is a mark and a stress that activates a slap back. I did all kinds of things for him, didn't it? Isn't that great? Oh, that's totally worth getting the slap backs. Yeah. Keep slapping them. For that much damage, worth it. All right. You should be able to double hit here with, uh... Mm. Do this. It doesn't proc anything back, so that's good. Yeah, Tormente, let's go. Damn it, he couldn't kill the freaking thing. I'm actually shocked he didn't get that kill. Uh, this guarantees it if it hits, though. There we go, there we go. There we go. Okay. He dead next turn. Oh, well, okay. Didn't think he'd do that, to be honest with you. Huh. Served rare. No thanks. There was a face in there. Here comes Moldena. Then he just summoned the everybody this time. That's okay. We're fine. Take the stress. He's gonna stress out too, who cares? What's the worst that could happen? At this point, the fight's over. If we lose... I mean, yeah, if we lost at this point, uh, I'd be done. Probably with video games forever. Behold, the abyss is made manifest. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. You fucker. You infallible little fuck. Ugh. Actual annoying shit. Alright, alright. Shut up, shut up. Y'all is yelling at each other at this point. Um, I need the accuracy to hopefully hit this guy. It didn't kill him! You lame fucker. God damn it. We should be done. But you couldn't do 12 damage or whatever the hell it was. Jesus. actually upset. Yeah, just just kill them. Get them out of my life. Jesus. Alright, we just need to go faster than the infallible servitude, to be honest. Confusion, of course. God damn it, motherfucker. Okay, he went after the body. Thank goodness. Okay, and the Viscount himself has minus speed, so we should be able to go faster than him. Dude just needs to hit one time. Thank you. Let us hope he enjoyed his last meal. Good so lord. As it was. Uh, I don't even care about these two. They'll die. They'll die over time. Oh, the corpse just kind of hangs around here. Literally. Oh, there it goes. I don't know why it waited for that one that I don't know I don't know what's going on anymore there we go all right we're done it's past the turn it's up your stress the frick the hell was that Dagger of Libation for the Apostate. Uh, less stress healing received if Crimson Curse. Okay. Or less stress received, not stress healing. On friendly skill, buff damage. Ooh. On friendly skill, self, if not bleeding, bleed. Okay. That sounds interesting. These stinky ass boots. No, no, no. Give me this. You know what? Forget the camp, dude. We're leaving. I'm done. I don't want this team anymore. Uh, we got the Tin Flute. Stress resist. Extra stress healing while camping. Pretty nice for the leper, honestly. 
Good payday. I'll give you that much. And what do you get? Virulent Might. Extra damage of Crimson Curse on a person who... On the person who needs it less than anyone else. Yeah. My obsession Two free combat skills. Foulness, and it is shameful that I must rely upon you to set it It'd right. Great if we didn't have plenty of money. All right, yeah. Scroll. this one to journey elsewhere. I don't want them. We have need Especially you. Stock. We, lots of other classes that could use that. Another those trinkets. So. And nope. Nope, nope, nope. Like a spent torch. Well, that is going to be it for this episode of That Plays the Darkest Dungeon. If you enjoyed it, be sure to let me know by giving it a like. If you haven't already, feel free to subscribe for more. Because the coming will stop coming. Till it does, and then it probably will. Got any level 2 uh, Beastmasters? No? I'll keep looking then. Thanks again for watching this episode of Darkest Dungeon. My name is Thet, and I'll see you in the next video. Everybody owes.